Uh, now, uh, look, we have to go back to it. I feel we do. Uh, tomorrow we're going to get the second half of the Harry and Meghan Markle Netflix documentary about how cruel this world has been to these poor people and how mean the royal family has been to them. Here's Harry whinging again about the royals in the preview of what we're going to see tomorrow. They were happy to lie to protect my brother. They were never willing to tell the truth to protect us. I think that's been so far his most pointed uh, attack on his brother. How's this documentary turning out for uh, him and Meghan Markle? Well, I think incredibly badly, Andrew. It's, it's going to be, in total, six hours of trashing the royal family. Meghan Markle got her claws into Harry, she got her toes into the palace, and she's been on this rampage to destroy uh, the institution that it is. And sadly, Harry, who I think has mental health issues, has gone along with this. It's a very sad state of affairs, and I think this won't end, for, end well for this couple at all, Andrew. In fact, I've said for a long time, I think one day they will bust up and he'll regret the way he's behaved. She certainly won't because she's making a fortune out of it and dragging him along with her. Well, you know, I find this thing, this, this fascinating showcase into their total lack of reality, the total selfishness, their hypocrisy, their cruelty. Um, for instance, this I find it incredible that these two have been complaining about media intrusion into their lives when they turn out to have intruded into the... Queen's property with their photographer, who didn't just sneak a photo of them in Buckingham Palace without the Queen's permission, but even uh, snapped them having tea or pretending to in the Queen's outsized doll's house, which was given to the Queen when she was a girl. There's no way she would have allowed them to turn that into a, a prop for their documentary. I mean, this is just... If someone did this to them, they would be incandescent, and but they feel quite OK doing it to the Queen. Well, these two are utterly disgraceful in my view, Andrew, and the only good thing to come of this is that the late Queen is not here to listen and watch this trash because I think it's disgraceful what this pair are doing and making a fortune in the process. I think they should be ashamed of themselves and I think they're doing themselves immense harm because eventually this whole, uh, you know, business model they've got of destroying the royal family and making money will come to an end. Yes, absolutely so. Sophie Ellsworth, thank you so much for your time.